In this school spider tutorial, I'm going to show you how to bulk upload the parents um, to the administration area so that they can then log in to the uh, school parents area. So this little block here. So, so you can direct your parents to the website and then give them a login so they can access things like, uh, you know, online forms to fill in and get involved in forums, that sort of thing. So if I want to manage, uh, manage my parents and bulk upload my parents, I just click on this manage parents area. And then you see here I've got manage parents who can log in. Now I've got three options here. Uh, I'm going to show you how to bulk upload the parents. Um, there's another video as well to showing you how to manually add parents, but this one I'm showing you how to bulk upload the parents. Now if you can, and I know this might not be the right for all schools, but if you can, you really want to upload all the parents and all the pupils at the same time. And what this will enable you to do is it will automatically link the parents to the correct pupil. Um, as it stands here, we have, um, I'm just going to show you the pupils who can log in. We've got some pupils who are, who are registered on the site, but we don't, have any, um, we don't have any parents who are registered on the site. So what we need to do is bulk upload the parents and then manually attach them to a, to a, a pupil. So I'm just going to click bulk upload parents. Um, again, it's a, a CSV file that you export from Sims. So um, I'll just show you this CSV file, what it looks like here. I've got it open. So it's just one column with the parents' name in. And you see some of these, you can put the, you know, Mr. and Mrs. Bailey. Uh, so you can put, uh, you know, two people onto one login. Um, so this is what it looks like. It only has to be that one column. So I'm just going to click on the Choose Your CSV file. So I've got Parents List. So upload it here. So if I had the email address for the parents, I could map the email address to, to that column there, but I don't. So I'm just going to choose Parent Salutation. Automatically create the usernames and automatically create the passwords. And what would you like to do with this data? There's no parents on here, so just add these onto the exist, existing list. But you could delete the old parents and add these new ones. And then just press save. It's as simple as that. So that lets you know now the parents have been uploaded. So if I just go to list all parents now, or view of your uploaded parents, you'll see, see that all the pupils have been uploaded here. Um, and I'm sorry, all the parents have been uploaded. So you can go back through and just manually see what you know information has been added to them. You can see when they've logged in. Um, so I'm sorry if I just click into here. If you need to export this information, just click the export button at the top there, and then this will let you download a CSV file with all of the uh, parents' information in there. Um, and what that'll do is it'll enable you to um, to you know to link. Uh, to, to look at, to send these um, usernames and passwords out to the parents. Uh, okay, so um, once you've got them in there, what we then need to do is match the um, match the parent up to a pupil. So I've just cl clicked on Miss Baybot here. So what we need to do is because we've because we've just uploaded the parents, we haven't uploaded the pupils. We just need to manually attach each one of the parents to it. So. Um, Miss Baybutt, so you can see that we've got Alicia uh, Ashby. So I'll just link over to Alicia Ashby and just press save. So you see they're linked up to that particular um, pupil now. So if I just go to Mr. and Mrs. Bailey, so there we go, to so Adam Bailey. So you just have to link them up to the actual pupil. It's much better if you can do all the pupils and the parents in one go through the, the pupil upload. Um, watch our video on um, how to bulk upload pupils to that, and it will show you how to do everything all in one go.